I didn't even put an old silk hat on the snowman, sir. But it came alive anyway, in full defiance of nature. I see. Did you sing a song? No. Kenneth? Okay, sir. I sang Fumpty Fum Fum over the fields of snow. But that doesn't seem like an excuse for a snowman to come alive, sir. I'm afraid that snowmen are much more in touch with the spirit of the rules than the letter of them. That's unbelievable, sir. How did I ever win contracting disputes? I assume because it is not legal to sign a contract with the snowman. <laughs> well, that's very clever of them, sir. So has the snowman done anything wrong? Yes! Just the other day, I saw him in a tree, sir. That is no place for a snowman. I know, sir! The cow lives there! What else? And just before I came back inside the house, sir, I swear I saw two of them. That is very severe. They are planning evil, sir. Kenneth, I think you may be correct. What do we do, sir? I need you to collect a tuna, a cheese grater, and a megaphone. Sir, I am not summoning Aquaman again. He was very cross the last time. Well, the tuna was very relieved. Aquaman should be happy to be getting work. Well, wait, sir. I know. I have an idea. Meet me outside in half an hour. So, what exactly have you done, Kenneth? I built a complex machine. It's a trap for snowmen, sir. Oh, really? What will it do? Uh, nothing, sir. I tried using redstone to make it operate correctly, but then I remembered the redstone is like programming in binary, and I gave up. Redstone is stupid. Yeah, like math, sir. Isaac Newton should be ashamed. I heard Pythagoras didn't even invent the Pythagorean theorem. Truly, things we do not like are useless. So this is a failed project? No, sir. You can still light the dynamite when the snowman comes close. See here. Well. Those snowmen will never threaten the house again. I wonder if we can just leave out some poison traps. Uh, sir, I think I killed a tree cow. Do I need a license for that?